Hey guys, this is Yusei D. Wheeler here, and it's, again, it's been a long time since I made a video because, you know, school keeping me busy though, and then right now, and I have my spring quarter that starts next week, so yeah, I was using this whole week just to rest up and relax and just recharge my batteries though, and then, but I still do, I still do occasional some videos here, like some voice acting videos with friends though, but, but, Right now, this is for something different because I did get something today, though, that was released today, and it's not Vanguard related, though, but it's another card game, though, that I've picked up before, and it's the the new future card Buddy Fight Trial Deck, though. I mean, I got the the first Dragon World one when it was first released, and I did the, you know, the, the release tournament. I got some of the promos, though, but I didn't get much else after that, and I just got, like, a few cards here and there from it, though, because... I'm not really heavily invested in this game though, but this game is pretty fun if you want to try a different game other than uh, Vanguard and stuff, so. And I watched the anime though, the anime is pretty fun to watch though, I mean like, the new episode's out today I believe, though. I think the episode's on YouTube right now? I don't know, cause I just got home though, so I'll have to check when I get back, well, like when I get on my computer, which I just kind of turned on right now though, so. Yeah, alright, so uh, well, let us crack this guy open now. I know this card has this deck has a lot of the cards I want from the the Jackknife series though. There's a picture of the character who uses them named Tasuku Ryuenji. Oh, looks like you know, some stuff that comes in it. Let me just try focusing some stuff. All right, looks like it comes with some promo stuff. Let me kind of focus in on it. Focus. Okay, let me just kind of open this up right now. There's another reason why I want I, I bought four of these decks too, because first of all you get this thing called Green Dragon Knight's Song of the Ancient Lands. In order to cast this, you need to pay a gauge. You gain one life whenever your armor dragon enters the the field, so you and I can only have one of these on the field at a time, so yeah. And also you get the a promo gargantua punisher with Tasuku on it instead of uh, the main character Gal Mikado. So yeah, I wanted four of these things, so, yeah. So yeah, I bought. I went to my uh, hobby store and I bought four of them. Alright. Okay, these things have, these little things have tape on them though, so yeah. Let me just open these up, and yeah. Okay, these that come in like a rule book and a, kind of like a small comic rule book, a playing field, and a life point counter. So yeah. This is how you kind of move it up and stuff. But this one, since this is the jackknife trial deck, this, of course, is going to have Tasuku on it, though. Because the other ones, like, the first ones had Gao, the other ones had the other guy who uses Danger World. I forgot what that guy's name is, though, but yeah. And then now you got the deck, so let me just get this out. Alright, you get Jackknife Dragon. The main buddy monster of uh, Tasuku, which... I like the, what all these jackknife cards do, so basically... This one, you pay 2 gauge and you search your deck for a jackknife card, and then you kind of call it on top of it. So basically, this this card is meant to pretty much evolve and stuff, too. You get So you get one foil of a uh, jackknife dragon here. You get two jackknife thunderstorms. Which, oh yeah, these, ones, yeah, these are the ones that you call on top and they get the ability called Soul Guard, pretty much. So, pretty much you, like... Whenever, like, you say you place it on top of a uh, jackknife or so, you pretty much, whenever it's about to be destroyed, you can just kind of ditch the card from the soul just to keep it from the getting destroyed. So, yeah, you get two of those. You get a hollow jackknife dispersal and a regular jackknife dispersal. So, one of them is foil, one of them is not. So, that's pretty cool, too. Alrighty, you get Gus Charging Dragon. It's another, so that's pretty cool. Doesn't really do anything, just three damage. All right, and you get three non-foil jackknife dragons, though. So you get a total of four jackknives, which is cool. It says you want four of each of your buddies. You get two hammer mace dragon. All right. You get four of these size one. Zantetsu no Dachi Dragon. Size 1 just does 1 damage, but he's pretty strong for a size 1. 
You got four Gra Gravehorn Dragon. Three of these Slash Knife Dragons. These are the ones that can attack if you have a... Even if your opponent has a monster in the center. Two Lethal Shield Dragon. You get two Bronze Shield Dragon. And then for the spells, you get two Jackknife Braveheart, which is you pay two gauge. And then you search your card search your deck for a card with Jackknife in its name and add it to your hand. So this is pretty good. Another reason why I wanted more of the decks. You get four Dragon Flave with Get four of these ones to destroy a monster with 5,000 or less in the field, so that's pretty good. No cost to that, too. Okay, wait. Did I miss something? Oh, wait. You get three of these. And you get two Drago Energy, which is a counter that pretty much meant to, like, uh, overpower your opponent when it's attacking, so it pretty much destroys them when they gain 3,000 attack and defense, so yeah, that's pretty cool. You get two Dragonic Charges, just which is a counter card, and you use it, just charge the top two cards of your deck, which is pretty awesome. I like that. And then you get four uh, green dragon shield. Basically, you just if you have no cards in your uh, center, if you have no monster in your center, though, then it negates an attack and you gain a life point. And you get three Drago Brave. It's an equipment card for yourself. And three Drago Fearless. Just the standard equip. And then you get three impact cards. One of them the impact is foil as well, named Dragonic Punisher. It's a bit like Gargantua Punisher, though only you just pay four gauge and pay two life, and then does if your opponent has four le a life less. Like yeah, four less or life, and you have a size two or greater armor dragon, it just deals four damage. In a way, it's kinda like Gargantua Punisher, only this one you can work around, I guess. Alright. And then you get two non-foil ones too. And then, of course, since you get like a flag for your, for which whichever world you're using, so this one is Dragon World. Alrighty, so that's pretty much the the trial deck. So, so yeah, hope you enjoyed it though. And if there's if there's any more coming out for this set, I'll probably look into that too. But I'm not really heavily investing into this card. I'm in, this trial deck is enough for me to make this deck that I, the way I want it, though, so... Yeah, it's a pretty interesting game, though, like, if you want to try something different than Vanguard. But, yeah. I'm, I'll, I'll wait for more stuff to come out, though, and if there's more interesting stuff, I'll probably post more on that, too, so... Alrighty, though, so this is Yusei D. Wheeler, and I'll be signing out. Later, guys!